All right, looks like there's not much else. Let us continue with more of part six of Mega Man ZX Advent. There really hasn't been that much else. Because to be honest, there's still more that we gotta do. We gotta head back to area three. We're in Area 3. Yeah, last time we went, we took down Mega Man ZX and one of the f other four pseudoroids. Right here. <laughs> Aren't you the Model A Chosen One? Oh my bad, I forgot to introduce myself. They call me John. I never thought I'd meet a Mega Man in a Pudon camp like this. It must be my lucky day. Well, I haven't been too lucky till you showed up. I just come in this room when this door decided to stop working. I've been trapped in here since. I don't know why it would happen if you didn't come along. This trans server is one way only to the mysterious lab. Let's check it out. Where am I? I remember this place. This is the building I first woke up in. You were locked up here? If this is where you received your Mega Man preparation, there may be a clue about Albert's plan. Would you have a look? Be right back. Let's continue. I don't think I've been in this building, though. Okay, let's go check it out. Warpoint. Time to see what this is all about. Okay, this ain't working. Let's go, Model ZX. Well, at least that's easier. Let's see what's in here. This lab's already making me trying to figure out what's going on. Wait, so how do I get this? What's up there, anyway? And what's this? This is just like the capsule I was in. Look at that panel! There's a message! Dan001, Prometheus. Time remaining before shutdown for recalibration. 246,924 seconds. 
Dan002, Pandora. Time remaining before shutdown for recalibration, 246,939 seconds. These are Prometheus and Pandora's capsules. Those two were made here too? Maybe they're what the data meant by Reploid siblings. I bet the first two Mega Men Albert made were Prometheus and Pandora. <gasps> There's no doubt about it. These capsules are the chains that bound them. So that they wouldn't go against Albert's plan. Chains? The counter on the panel is probably Prometheus's life. It's set pretty short. They're made so that they'll die if they don't go back into the capsules for maintenance at regular intervals. In order to stay maintained, they have to do what Albert says. It looks like this building goes further in. There may be something left. Keep looking. I'll do that. Managing it so far. Hi. Thank you. All right, Atran's on. Okay, so if there's anything else... Oh my god. I gotta drop it all the way down. Let's see what's up here. A sub tank. Oh, I see. I think I need a certain vile metal. I think I need the other. I think I need that other one. But we will come back here later. Thankfully, they're all set. War points online. He's hiding something in here, too. Well, you're just gonna have to get out of the way. Hey, hey, do you think you could just ignore me, Headshock? You've got to face the penalty, a shocking penalty. Mr. Albert's orders are absolute. And my orders are to take you down. Now watch how I do things. Oh, 
believe me. You're about to be put on ice. Don't move, for my sake. Can you, like, not do that? No damage. Hey, hey! That kind of strength is cheating! It's just like... Mr. Albert's strength! <laughs> Still, I cannot stomach this. And I know someone's gonna complain of the voice acting they tried. But it would have been much if they could just, like, I don't know, redo it? We obtain Headshock's data. Is there only this one capsule? But it's empty. There's something showing on this panel, though. Dan 000. Prototype final version complete. Start final phase. There were Mega Men being made even before Prometheus and Pandora? The process is finished, and the capsule is open. Huh? There's a disk still in this drive. We gain a data file B. Very good, but all you manage to find is an empty capsule and some incomplete data? There might be some Mega Men that we don't know about. We'll analyze the data here and see what we can find. Send it with your mission report. I'll do that. The passage up ahead is really low. Crouching looks like the only way to get in. But with these obstacles in the way, we can't get all the way through. I've got it. Try morphing into head shock. Then hold down the control pad and press dash. That way you can slip under. Headshock's abilities aren't very good on the offensive, so you should avoid using her against enemies. You can shoot balls of electricity holding down the attack button and releasing it. Well, come on, let's use Rolling Dash to get into that passageway. Mission reports submitted and we get 300 EC. And we transfer the data file B. All right, at least with that done, now we gotta head all the way up here. You gotta head back. And I really like how you can speed your way through. Oh yeah, I already went through that. You know what? Let's tackle this one. When it comes to skill with a buster, there's nobody in Hunter's Camp even close to me. I could care less if you're supposed to be some Mega Man or whatever. All I know is you ain't even my league. If you don't believe me, just go to the firing range up ahead and challenge my record. I'll even give you this room key. Give the key back when you're finished, though. As a matter of fact, I'll pay you 100 CC if you beat my record. Fine. Let's go. Got it. There is no way I'm going to be able to get down all of that. Yeah, 
The only advice is that you got to do it eight at a time. Yep, 90. Yep, I tried. 90. So you couldn't beat my record, huh? Well, that's too bad. Let me know if you want to give it another try. Let's head this way then. It's me, Mikhail. About the information we found on you in the Legion's database, it appears that someone hacked in front of the outside and erased it. It had to be Albert. We did all we could to pinpoint the location of the hacker, but the network response is slow in the area you're in. Can you see a large computer facility in that area? Computer facility? No, I can't see anything from here. I'm afraid we can't do anything else. Now it's up to you. If you can find the computer used to do the hacking, there may still be some data on it. The missing data on you is one of the only clues that are left to track down Albert. The computer used to hack my data could be around here? Okay, I'll look for it. And now a boss fight. <laughs> Wait right there! I don't care who you are, but I can't allow you to continue any further! Hmm. A pseudoroid? Are you in league with Albert? That's right! Call me Argoyle! Hmm. And he's my other half, Ugoyle! We will defend this area with our lives! I see! So the computer used to do the hacking is in there! Do you think you can break through our defenses? Hmm. Then come on, Mega Man Model A! Let me show you the way! The way to the Netherworld! End of the line for you! We'll see. Time for an A-Trans of sorts. Yep, gotta slow it down. Look, you're just a joke right now. Bye bye. You, me, we're broken. No. You managed to win this battle, but you won't survive this war! <sighs> what a joke. We at least obtain Argoyle and Ugoyle's data. To leave Pseudoroid standing guard, Albert must really not want anyone to see what's in there. I'm sure that computer is this way. Let's go! Gray, take a good look over there. There's something on the other side of that wall. Press the attack button and Argoyle can throw bombs. Press the other attack button and release it to summon Ugoyle. Ugoyle can pass through obstacles and get items behind walls. Press the button you use to summon Ugoyle to make Ugoyle kick. If you time it right, you can have Ugoyle kick rock bomb that Argoyle throws. Also, you can adjust the throw tra trajectory of the rock bombs by pressing up or down on the control pad. Rock bombs are designed to bounce once before exploding, so practice to use this to your advantage. Wait, so I gotta do this? So that's how it works. Either way, let's continue. 
Let's see what the rest of this series got. Okay, looks like we're gonna have to design on Model Z. That means I've gotten like everything. Although the last one is a massive pain again. Yeah, like that, don't you? Yeah, you didn't notice about that? Yeah, Model L can actually swim through waterfalls and avoid projectiles. Just a little bit of a heads up. There's a hidden item in there. Fine. Fat out. Hmm. Nope. That means I gotta do an air dash. Not that air dash. At least we can keep at least we can get lives endlessly. That's better. Let's move on. Going up. Thought you never knew that, did you? So it's more dead ends. How appropriate. Or not, because I can avoid all that entirely. Oh, I see what this gimmick is all about. Okay, now I'm starting to understand this little gimmick. Who am I kidding? Why should I just like do that when you can just slow it down outright?
No! Why didn't it work? Oh yeah, you need Model F. Oh, that's really rich. How many lives I got left? I got four lives left. Let's see if I can slow down time just to reach it. Oh, come on! You know what? Forget it. As much as I want to try it, forget it. this thing. No way I'm going to reach that. Wait, what's this? Finally made it to the fourth area. That thing isn't going to let me go without a fight. Okay, so now I know what I gotta do. We need to take this thing down. Yeah, shut it down. Yeah, goodbye. Thank you, Model F. Someone beat us to it! The computer! Were you the ones that did it? That's right. We've entered the final stage of the plan. We don't need to hack anymore. 
But we couldn't just let you go snooping around in there looking for information about yourself either. And we can't let you, who beat five Mega Men, just retire. What? The reason we've kept you alive is all part of the plan. Soon, it will all be over. The destiny of destruction. <laughs> Albert, as well as his stupid game, are about to be over! As Albert meets his demise! The end of Albert? What do you mean? What are you going to do? I'll tell you when it's all over. Perhaps as you are dying. <laughs> We'll meet again. W wait Dang! What's happening? Wait, what? Those two weren't working for Albert? What about the computer? Is there anything left of it? Oh, man. We get data file A. That's it. There's nothing left. Don't feel so bad. Even without data, you are very real and you exist in this world. The proof is in the fact that they went to so much trouble to keep you from seeing the data. Let's investigate the data we do have on our own. Send it together with your mission report. Indeed. Mission report submitted and we get 300 AC and transfer the data file. It's Thomas. We've succeeded in analyzing a file in the data you found. This is an initialization key for a special trans server. It contains transport coordinate data of some kind. We were able to completely recover it using the data that you sent. We gain an in initialization key. Do you remember ever seeing a trans server that hadn't been initialized? A trans server that hadn't been initialized. If you find it, use that key. It's the data that had been split in two and guarded so vigilantly. Albert is presumably at the receiving end of that trans server. So I can initialize a trans server with this key? Okay, I'll give it a try. Now let's save the game. But for now, before we progress further, let's clean things up. Because there's actually a lot more we can do. And I'm not kidding, there is a lot. Yeah, because we already maxed out our battle metal gauge. We gotta do the same for this. clean up everything. This also includes side missions. Trans it up. Yeah, because there's actually a place that we missed out on.
Jeez. Here we go. Now we gotta blast these things. Come on. That did it. So it seems we have a quest on our hands. Mer, it's cold. I should have dressed warmer. Oh, what am I going to do? I caught a moth queen, but I got away. Won't someone catch it for me? There you go. My Moth Queen! You caught it for me! You are a hunter! Oh, thank you! I'm so glad you came to my aid. It isn't much, but I want you to have this. We gain 100 AC and hand it over to the Moth Queen. They say Moth Queens are popular with celebrities because they're so beautiful. I'm going to sell these beauties to earn enough money to become a hunter someday. Oh yeah, we gotta increase the weight. Take that, take that, take that. You're serious? That didn't work. I see. Oh, come on, really? Head airborne. Nice. Now I got the second sub tank. There are four sub tanks in this game, and unlike in Mega Man ZX, you can actually get all four. Let's just drop down. Nice. That should shred. 
Oh yeah, you need Chrono Force. Push it all the way up. Yeah, that's the other advantage. Goodness, I got the sub tank. Now we get to this part. Oh, yeah, I already blasted them. It's just that I'm one short. There's the last one. Now with that shut down, we need to find ourselves all the way back up there. Now this leads to this room here. Wait, there's nothing here. So, the whole point of this entire room is absolutely nothing. Wow, what a total waste. Okay, I'm already drawing a brain fart. I got what I needed out of it, so let's move on. Thankfully, I activated the last warp CC point.
Okay, so what else am I missing? I know I gotta clean up everything. Fine, let's head to the float. We gotta go through every area one by one just to find everything. This time I got Model H helping me this time. Aha, something is down there. Then what was all that about? It's because of that beam you can't latch on the walls. Thank God I saved my game beforehand. Nope, don't see anything out of the ordinary. Oh, nice. That saved me. This is already messed up.
Oh, good. Ah. Yep. Not gonna make it. Yeah, what a drag. Yeah. I will see you guys in the next part. Forgot to save. But don't worry. I'll make sure it's corrected. If you enjoy it, please be sure to hit the like button. It means a lot to me. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and click the bell. It helps out big time. I'll see you in the next part where I hopefully, like, get what I missed, and then we'll continue. This is Mega Man NG signing off. Peace out.